Hey guys, welcome back to a new video on the channel. Today we're going to go over how to send and receive files from clients. So let's say you've got your first client and now you're wondering, now how the hell do I receive and send the file back to them, the final project back to them? So don't worry today, I've got you covered, so stay tuned. Hey guys, welcome back to a new video on the channel. My name's Jack Fern, I'm a freelance videographer, photographer and video editor. So if that's something you're interested in, stay tuned and subscribe to the channel, check out some of my other videos. And if you want to support the channel, go buy me a coffee, a link in the description. So anyway, how do we send and receive files from a client? Say it's your first client, you don't know how to do it. We've got a number of options. Number one, we can use WeTransfer. Now WeTransfer is quite a one-stop shop for just sending it and being done with it. But if it's a more long-term client, we're going to be wanting to look into Google Drive or Dropbox. I personally use Google Drive. I find I've always used it. I find it so much easier than Dropbox. But depending on that, you can choose what you want to do. So it's just a file sharing service. You can upload the files. You can create a folder, upload the files and stuff like that, and add it to it and share it to them so that you can access it and stuff like that. So how do we actually receive files first? So what you want to do is send them your email, and then they're going to send you a little email like this. As we can see here, I've got my little email, I've emailed myself. Hey Jack, your favourite client here. Here's a link to the clips for the video and they're going to send you a link to the actual drive or wherever is the, the platform that they're using to share the video with or the clips with. The deadline for this is next Thursday at 10pm GMT time. If you have any questions, you've pinged me a message. Many thanks, your favourite client. So they'll send something like that over and they'll send the actual clips over so you can start editing it. So what are you going to do? I'm going to click it and we're gonna open it up and then they're gonna send something like this hopefully you've got a lot of, a lot of footage which means a long big project which means you can get a lot more money so we're just gonna click it open and then what we can do or what we can actually do if, if depending on if you're using drive or not you can right click and just download and that's gonna download all of the clips in there it's gonna zip it's gonna be a zip folder and what that means is, is all, it's a ton of files compressed into one. So you're going to need like a software like uh, WinRAR or something else like that. Something that you can extract the folders with from the zip folder. So uh, once this is finished downloading, I'll get back to you. So guys, once it's done downloading, what you can do, you can go to your downloads. And then you're going to need a, a software such as WinRAR or something like that that you can extract it with. So what we're going to do, we're going to drag it uh, into a new folder. Simple, simple. Open that folder, and then once you've got, I use WinRAR, as you can see here, WinRAR zip archive. Right click, and then extract here. And then what it's gonna do, is gonna extract the folders and the files into this folder. And once it's done, it's gonna um, obviously be done. And then we've got our little clip, and we've got our stuff that we can use to edit and stuff like that. So that's how you receive files from your clients. So they're gonna send you an email, or something like that, send you an email, Send a link or like to whatever it is you're going to use Dropbox, Google Drive, we, uh, we transfer. You're going to download it and then you're going to put it into your, into your folder and you're going to edit. So once you've edited it, how do you send it back to them? One thing I like to do is to go back to the original folder, is go back to my drive, I mean not my drive, wherever it was, it was here. Go into DSLR or something or whatever the folder was called and click new, create a new folder. And then call it call it edited or edited or whatever it's called. You know, edited uh, promo video, and then hit uh, enter, and then do, and then say if this is the final edited piece of work, drag it in, and then copy, it, and then it's going to start uploading, and then go to good. One. And then what you can do, you can come over to here, share, and then put type in their email on here, and then you can share it with them and then you're done. Or if it is their folder, they'll have access to it, they've added you to it. So that's how you send and receive files for your clients. Anyway guys, I hope you like this video. If you like what you see here, subscribe to the channel. If you want to support the channel, buy me a coffee, link in the description. And if you want to learn the basics of Adobe Premiere Pro, check that video up there. It goes over all the basics to import your clips, edit the basics, and then export it for social media, YouTube, whatever it is. So if you like what you see here, subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you in the next video, guys.